our enemy created an army for us. If this was known, public confidence in the war effort, the Jedi, and the Republic would vanish. There would be mass chaos. Yoda and Mace Windu responding to a mysterious distress call, Plo Koon discovered a crashed Jedi shuttle, and found the lightsaber of Sifo Dyas in the wreckage to the surprise of the High Council. Sifo Dyas' lightsaber had been lost since his death a decade prior to the Clone Wars. Skywalker and Kenobi were sent to investigate, which led them to discover that Sifo Dyas had, in fact, been murdered by pipe criminals rather than the native Felutians he had been sent to negotiate with, as the Council had previously assumed. Furthermore, they learned that the Pikes had been acting on orders from Count Dooku. A confrontation between Dooku and the Jedi on the Obadiah moon led the Order to discover that Dooku was the mysterious Tyranus who hired Jango Fett as the clone template, making him responsible for the clone army's creation. The High Council now knew that the Sith were involved in the development of clone troopers. However, they did not understand why their own enemy would provide them with the means to defend the Republic. Windu noted with caution that such a revelation could easily destroy public confidence in the Jedi, the Republic and the war effort. The conspiracy was therefore classified as confidential information. Yoda himself ordered his colleagues to not speak of the discovery to anyone, including Chancellor Palpatine. He also dismissed any doubts concerning the clone troopers, citing their valiant service and loyalty to the Jedi. Windu was uncertain about Yoda's decision but the Grand Master assured him that it was the only feasible option available to the Jedi Order given the circumstances.